I have cancelled my account with my mailbox because, and this is related to this. Cheers, Spanner. This is the second console that they haven't given to me in the past four weeks. I had a customer call me up this afternoon, this morning, uh, literally like nine o'clock this morning, asking about an update on his console, sent it in on the 6th. Well, sorry, it was delivered on the 6th and I hadn't received it. So I've cancelled my membership with the uh, the mailbox. I've signed up for a PO box, but I've got to wait till the 26th for that to become active. Yeah, so this, this is the second time in a month and like, one time, fair enough, it's a mistake, whatever, but two times in a month, no. Um, so, yeah, luckily the customer understands um, and he's okay with it. But, yeah, I'm just sick of it. And with Royal Mail, it's cheaper. So, yeah, I'll be getting a P.O. box. The superior end, welcome. Not the first time I've boxed on this, no. Uh, so, yeah, this is... It's fairly straightforward. I wouldn't normally do this on stream, but I did say because of the situation, I'd deal with it today. So, you know, even though I only received it literally at 2 o'clock. But yeah, we got no picture. No display. Let's just give the cable a wiggle. I'm going to reset my capture card just to make sure it's not that. It is not that. We get no display at all. Right, I'm just going to clean the HDMI cable. Make sure it's not that. I'm going to rule everything out. I'll just pop some IPA on the cable. I did do a Series X for my uh, sister this afternoon and the HDMI was playing up. But that was my cable again. It was only a disk drive repair. Still nothing. Let's plug it into my microscope just to make sure. Yeah, there we go. So that's picked up my um, microscope. So my capture card's working. So yeah, no display. All right. HDMI port looks fine. Today's video is sponsored by PCBWay. Whether you've got a simple project that requires a quick mod board or you want to launch your own products to the world, PCBWay can help. With fantastic pricing on multi-layer PCBs, flex PCBs, 3D printing and even laser cutting solutions, you're sure to get everything you need all in one place. Custom PCBs start from just $5 for a 1-2 to two layer board with a fast 24 hour build time and free shipping on orders over $30. PCBWay are also proud to announce their new aluminium PCBs which start at just $120 per square metre. Check out what PCB we have to offer by clicking on the link in the video description or the top pin comment and get your project started today. Thanks again to PCB Way for sponsoring the video. Let's get back to the repair. So I wouldn't normally do these no displays on stream, but I want to get to it now because he's already been waiting since the 6th and that's taking the piss. So I've cancelled the account anyway. So, if you plan to send anything in, don't. Oh, damn, this is clean. For an Xbox One S, this is clean. Damn. The customer got the hoover on it, probably. I went to get the hoover on my console the other day, but it sucked. Ha! Got him! Ha! Got him! Oh dear, what have we got? This ain't good. This ain't good at all. It's no wonder it's clean. It's been worked on. And not very well. I see burn marks all over the HDMI circuit. And definitely not the perfect amount of thermal paste. Oh no. What have they done to your poor little Xbox? Yeah, this is a little bit messed up. Thank you, Rexpain. Yeah, so someone's put a TDP on here, but not very well. There's no solder on the damn thing. Um, I think what I'll do first, I'll clean everything up. So I'm going to heat it all up and just clean up all this flux. And 
I think I'm just going to re-solder this to start with, to be honest. I'll see how it goes. So, the story behind this, the customer said that he was given to it by a friend or a family member, I think, and the customer, the person who gave it to him said, if you can fix it, you can have it, basically, for free. So, no wonder. I don't know where it's been in the past. Yeah, absolutely no solder at all on that, um, on those pads. It's never going to work like that. But yeah, the solder hasn't contacted it at all, look. Someone's literally just took the chip off and tried to drop a new one straight on without retinning anything. So that's probably not going to accept solder now, so I'm going to need to tin it. Right, so there's the chip tin, so that's ready to accept solder now. Or rather, ready to be installed on the board. Yeah, look at that. Look at, look at the state of that. It's just insane. Right, what I'm going to do with this, because this is really oxidised, and I just don't... Trust it. So I'm tinning all these pads here. But then I'm going to wick it all away. I'm not, I know you might think that's a waste of time, but it's going to get rid of all of the oxidation. Because right, just tinning it alone sometimes doesn't get rid of all the oxidation. And just given the circumstance of how this has been treated, I don't trust this board in the slightest. I'll do what I can to get it working, but... So if you look at that, look, you can see there's still oxidation on the board. Some of those pads. But the solder blade will basically scrape the pads back. Like that look. They don't have to be clean clean, I just need to get rid of the oxidation off them. I'm going to grab a donor board in a second, make sure we're not missing any caps. Alright. That's accepting solar a lot easier now. Right, let's just get rid of that excess solder. There was quite a bit under that chip. I'll press down on the chip now.
There we go. Okay, gorgeous. Okay, look at those solder joints. Beautiful, mate. Right, I'm gonna just clean all this off. It does look fresh, to be honest, but meh. Ugh, way too much on here, that's for sure. I mean, too much thermal paste, well, there's no such thing as too much thermal paste. Um, all it's going to do is just make a mess. But it would still cool it adequately, but... Like, just look at that. Like, it's almost impossible to clean up. It would still cool it adequately, it just makes a mess. Doesn't look very good. I'm cleaning it up as best I can. Oh, um, yeah, Vince is good. Vince is a good guy. Yeah, see, they haven't even cleaned the old thermal paste off here. Look, look how crispy it is. Like, whoever's worked on this hasn't even cleaned the old thermal paste off. They've just put fresh thermal paste on the top, which is why I wanted to clean it off as well, because you never know. Yeah, Vince and Steve, uh, they're good people. All right, there we go. Brush this down, because it ain't been cleaned right. All right, let's see if that fixed it. But this is why I'm not putting it back together yet, just in case. Do you believe in magic? Scoop, scooby dooby doo bop. Scoop, scooby dooby 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 doo bop. Yeah, magic. No, there won't be any data on this. He's done that factory reset thing with the buttons. Is it a Chinese Xbox? No, it just skips through the languages. Uh, right, let me just sync up and control that. I might. I have to switch off the display. Yeah, it wants to update. No, nope, Xbox Game Pass is a scam. Right, you're going to pick up 4K? Yep. There we go. It's working in 4K. Lovely old spin. Spinning hard drives. 4K. Picking up network. Uh, test the disk. Right, are you going to pick up my very, very, very scratched up disk? Yes, you are. Okay. Not going to sit there and wait for 80 gig to install, though. No, thank you. No, it got wiped. They pressed the buttons. There we go. My account is deleted and done. Yeah, that was nice and easy. Um, just a very badly soldered HDMI retimer. I will take it. In this case, because of the situation on this, because of the... The fact that the mailbox messed up and didn't give me this for a couple of weeks. Um, and the fact that I haven't actually had to put any parts on it. I'll probably just charge a £40 bench fee on this rather than my normal um, 60 quid for the retimer. Yeah, I'll just charge a bench fee on this. Um, I'll invoice him in the morning. We are going to be working on a couple of PS5s next. Right, on to the next one, I guess. 